Okay, I've done videos on suspension balance, I've done videos on weight balance. This video is on low center of gravity and why that is provides an amazing driving experience and why Tesla is a leader in low center of gravity vehicles. Well, first of all, why does Tesla have low center of gravity and others don't? Well, it's because everything is down low. All the weight is down low. Right below my feet is a battery pack that spans the entire width between the front and left and right front wheels and the back wheels. The whole thing, this whole floor panel is battery. And it weighs between 1,000 and 1,500 pounds depending upon your specific model of Tesla and how big the battery pack is. That's an incredible amount of weight way, way down low, which puts the center of gravity down low. Now, where's the other major heavy component? The motors, the motors are also way down low right in the axle, they're not, they don't need to be up this high for the front and the trunk, that's why you have this, this space, extra space in the front and rear of a Tesla to store things because, whoa, look at this, because they just don't need to put this giant heavy thing there. So all the weight is down low, all of us down low. Now what does that mean in terms of the driving experience? It means that you're going to feel like this car is planted to the pavement. Because anytime you've got weight up high, when I say up high, I mean above the wheels or even the center of the wheels is considered high because once you have weight above the center of the wheels, the ability for that vehicle to tip over when you take a hard corner increases dramatically. And especially the higher that weight and the larger and heavier that weight, the more a vehicle will tend to roll over. And then you, that's why you notice like SUVs and pickups rolling over, they have rollover problems because they have all this weight up high. Now, I'm driving an SUV, I'm driving the Model X SUV, and all the weight is down low. It does not drive or feel like any SUV or truck. Even though it's high off the ground, I can raise the suspension off the high, even higher too, all the weight is still pretty much below the middle of the wheels, and way below, way below the middle, actually, in, in, uh, for almost all the weight of this vehicle. So it is nearly impossible to tip this thing over, and actually, I've shown videos, there is one specific video I have on my channel here where Tesla did some testing, they tried to roll it over, they actually got it to roll almost all the way over, and by the time it was about to roll over, it rolled back onto its tires. Okay, so search the channel to find that. That's just crazy, but that's what low center of gravity does. So if you haven't ever thought about that, just know that any internal combustion engine design is compromised because any internal combustion engine vehicle is going to have a higher center of gravity, in some cases, significantly higher, especially once you raise the, uh, the height of the frame off the ground it tends to roll over. So not only do Teslas not roll over, but they have an incredibly low center of gravity because all their platforms are designed for electric only with batteries in the middle of the car only. They are not designed to ever carry the weight of a hybrid vehicle, which includes an internal combustion engine or an internal combustion engine only. And a lot of, plat a lot of automakers that are getting into EVs are designing platforms that are multiple use for internal combustion engines, like I think Toyota's doing this and also for hybrids and those are going to be inherently compromised platforms when it comes to the concept of center of gravity and a, and a moving away from a lower center of gravity moving towards a higher center of gravity. Anytime you do that you compromise negatively the driving experience. So this is one of the reasons why Teslas are such amazing vehicles. Like I said all their platforms are like this. So let me know in the comments any kind of high or low center of gravity vehicles you've driven, if you've, rolling over, if you've rolled over some vehicles, let me know. I'd love to hear all this because this is important because a lot of people don't even understand or consider this when they're buying a car, but this is one of the amazing benefits of driving a pure electric vehicle, pure electric platform chassis uh, and on a Tesla. Other, and other manufacturers can do it, but they're not really doing it right now. And if you know of another manufacturer that's doing a similar platform, let me know in the comments too. But be sure to like, share, subscribe. Hit the thumbs up and the bell for notifications and we will see you in the next video.